First of all, what is a YubiKey? And, so a YubiKey, and why do I need one? So I, that was actually going to be my lead in. Do you use one? Um, no, because it sounds too complicated every time. Because, you know, we, we I think we listen to the same podcast here for the most part. And, and YubiKeys get brought up whenever they're talking about big security, right? Um, and that is always kind of like, ah, it's one more thing to worry about. I'll end up locking myself out of something. Like, I've always been concerned about something like that, right? Uh, so, so what does it do? And for the regular Joe, does my mom need a YubiKey? Does your mom have a bank account? Like, I, like yeah, okay. I'm, I'm getting right. to the point where I'm getting to the point where I've seen so many different random services leak their password lists. So I guess here, you don't need one of these if you have a password management tool and every tool, every account that you have has a complex different password from one another okay i feel better about that what if i was on last pass and i don't know where those passwords are <laughs> then you're sad <laughs> then i'm, um, then I'm then what? you're gonna be sad then right? i'm gonna be sad one of these days because right. i don't i don't have the effort to move it and i'm, I'm invested right now it, so what this does is it lets you kind of move to a passwordless system where you can kind of push the key to this type of a device and you use this device typically in lieu of a password. Mm -hmm. um, if you've ever done on the Xbox nowadays, if you sign up for passwordless and you use the Microsoft Authenticator app, um, you no longer get a password um, or the, it, you no longer use the password for your account. Um, you get a push notification on your device. Um, and then you, it gives you a two-digit number. You pump that back in, and you you move on with your day. Mm -hmm. um, this kind of even takes that out of the equation, gets you off the password, gets you off the MFA, and you just use this with your account information. It's kind of a <clears throat> what you know is your account, and what you have is this little dongle. Um, you don't have to worry about the password piece. Okay. Um, the cool thing is, and one of the things they will say is, hey, don't lose this thing. Mm -hmm. um, or, hey, get two of them. Um, because most things will let you register multiple keys to their service. We got a dramatic um, zoom when you said that. <laughs> yeah, I know. I didn't notice that. <laughs> that was a while. <laughs> um, it seems like sometimes, like when I like readjust, yep. Yep. there it goes. Yeah, yeah, it's adjusting um, for that. <laughs> If you but, knew the yeah. trigger, you get really <laughs> dramatic on us, and you're like self-producing yourself. I was like, "Oh, okay." But the, the, but for Black Friday or well, it's actually Cyber Week. They're buy one get one fifty percent mm -hmm. off. And Ubico, the maker of Ubikeys, um, they now make them pretty much for. You can buy one that's dual purpose, right? Like. They have them that's USB-A and the device's near-field communication, or it's USB-C and near-field communication. They actually have one that's lightning on one side, USB-C on the other. Um, they have nano ones that you can pretty much, I wouldn't recommend this, but you can pretty much leave in your laptop mm -hmm. um, because they almost, pr they practically sit flush with the, the end, end of the device. Um, I don't know. <clears throat> Because they're buy one get one fifty percent off, I'm heavily inclined to set this up.